Just a walk in the woods that yielded a surprise for Ray Alvey. Not know what I expected. I was shell-shocked right there. The maker of diamond willow canes was searching these woods near his home for the perfect branch when he found instead... This is the puck. ...a piece of his past. I've seen that round thing in the mud there, and I thought it was a snuff can. And I picked it up, and there was a, a puck with my initials on it. Are you both sides jackknife carved with the cut of a left-handed young teenager? And that's how I made my U all these years in school, even. Now really? back in the hands of its 88-year-old owner. Now it's flabbergasted. How could something like that be sitting right there? And I walked up, just about stepped on it after 70-some-odd years. I couldn't share it with any of his buddies because they were all dead. I must have went to 10 houses so excited about this puck carrying it with me in a napkin so I wouldn't do any damage. It's made by Winwell Corporation. They're located in California. Still in business. Got an email that says our products are last a lifetime. Ray isn't sure how his puck ended up in these woods. The rink was a block away and his slap shot wasn't that good. But he's sure it was special to him. My dad wouldn't pay a quarter for a puck. Back in them days, you had one at the fall of the year, and it lasted all winter. Special then, even more so now. Maybe it found you. That could be, too. One of the last things I'll have. <laughs> Boyd Hoopert, Carol Evan News, Duluth. Never know.